Welcome everybody back to another episode of the first look and on the first look this time we're going to look at the new Batman movie that's coming out in 2021 uh, starting, starring Robert Pattinson. Now the first images of this movie has finally uh, been released. Uh, they did like a test like vid uh, video of him actually in the suit of the Batman. You don't really see too much because it's got a red tone uh, to, the, to the images and stuff like that. You see a little bit of what the symbol look like on the costume and everything and to be honest you know it's Batman. Batman's Batman to me uh, as long as it ain't got the fucking nipple from like Batman and Robin and shit we I think it will all be good and everything um, but first images that we're seeing of from the Batman is uh, pretty good um, a lot of things are I'm looking you know I'm looking a little bit forward to this movie I feel maybe they might even though it's been said it won't be connected to the DCEU I wish it would be uh, they can really do some things with flashpoint and things to make it where it would connect um, I like the direction of what I'm seeing out of this movie. They're going with a lot of star power for this movie. Um, you got um, Zoe Kravitz who's going to be coming in as uh, Catwoman in this movie. And even though I didn't really care for her character in X-Men First Class, um, but she is you know, pretty hot and everything. So I'm kind of curious of what kind of Catwoman she'll bring. Um, I wasn't real big on Anne Hathaway. To me, Catwoman will always be, in my opinion, uh, Michelle Pfeiffer. Michelle Pfeiffer did a great job in Batman Returns, so I'm looking forward to her. Then you got Andy Serkis, who's coming in in this movie. I don't know quite who he's playing yet. I think I had heard where he's playing Alfred, but I'm not positive on this. Uh, but he's a great actor, great actor, and and just to have him on board in the first in the first place is fantastic. They also got Colin Farrell coming in and apparently he is playing the penguin in this movie um i had heard it's going to be part of arkham and that they're going to be doing uh like it's going to be a very detective type movie and that is actually really interesting itself because we have not really gotten a great detective type batman uh christian bells was a little bit uh like when he's for instance like in uh dark knight when he's analyzing the bullets and stuff like that of uh, you know but the joker did um and then of course we got a couple set photos here uh, where you know it shows robin Pattinson on a bike i guess you know with a mask over his face and, you know probably like the start of his batman career possibly so it's kind of interesting to see how this is going to go um i am interested in this movie i hope it you know it's going to be good i didn't want another batman trilogy batman reboot um i it's just, I don't know, I felt they, they needed to build on the DCEU. As long as it's, if it gets connected and does kind of well, I would be alright with it. But you know what, in a ways, it is what it is. Um, I am looking forward to it. I can't, you know, want to see a little bit more of it. And as time goes on, because uh, this of course coming out in 2021, we got a long time yet still, because they're currently filming it. Um, probably before we actually get a, a real teaser to the movie um but at least we got this footage of him of at least what he might he's going to be looking like maybe in this suit even though it's not a great image of it uh but what do you guys think leave it in the box below and until next time that has been my first look at the batman